Hi, Maddie. What are we going to do today? Making a sea turtle. This is what my mommy already made. Yeah, I already made that. So we are going to make a sea turtle using an old CD or a DVD that we're not using anymore, right? Right. So ask your moms and dads for a CD that they don't use anymore, one that's scratched. But don't just take any DVD or CD. Make sure that your mom or dad says that it's okay to use. So go ahead, Madeline. Let's start making yours. Okay. Okay, so to get the outline of the body, all we're going to do is take the CD that we're going to use and just trace it. I recommend using a pencil so you don't really see the outline of it, but I'm using the Sharpie just so that you can see it on the screen. So first we're going to trace it, then we're going to draw the head. Um, you can do it however you want. It doesn't have to be perfect. It'll still look pretty cool. So I'm going to do the head gonna do the arms it's a sea turtle so they're gonna kind of swim with these so that's why we're gonna do legs like that and then we're gonna do a little tail and some legs and again it doesn't have to be perfect but there you go and now you're just gonna cut it out and put it together on the, the same CD. time I already cut out the, the turtle's body and Madeline is going to start gluing the, uh, the turtle body onto the CD. Now make sure that you're going to glue it onto the side with the writing because we want the other side, the shiny side, to be seen because that's the side that we're going to decorate with stickers or... or there, I'm all done. Yeah. Okay, so go ahead and put the turtle body on there. Great, now turn it over and let's start decorating it. Okay. How about you put your glue down and start coloring the legs or the arms and the, the eyes? How about I do the eyes first? Oh, okay, great. Now the eyes that we're using, now you can just draw the glues, the eyes if you want, or we have some of these little googly eyes. See how they move? Madeline likes eyes with, with eyelashes, so we have these. This is what we're going to be using. Yeah, and the girl and the teachers at my school say that, that, the, that the, the eyes that are like this. With eyelashes? With eyelashes are girls. Oh, really? But don't boys have eyelashes too? Yeah, but the teachers say that the sticker ones and the googly eyes say that that only girl, only the girl ones are girls. Okay, well, they could be girls or boys, whatever you want. Okay, are you gonna make I a mouth? To. Are you gonna draw a mouth? What color are you gonna use? Red. Red. Okay, you're gonna make a smiley face. Yeah. Great. And then are you going to color the, the arms and the legs and the tail or are you just going to leave it white? I'm going to put these stickers on it. Okay, so you're going to you're going to decorate the shell. Yeah. Great. Now you can put stickers or if you don't have any stickers, you can just cut out pieces of paper, like construction paper, a bunch of different colors, and just glue it on. It's really up to you. We're using some jewel um, stickers. Here's some that I use on mine. Madeline's using some that are a little more fancy, but again, you can use whatever you want. So she's just gonna put on a few right yeah, there. I, I'm putting on purple, because purple is my favorite color. Purple is your favorite color. Yeah. When you go into Madeline's closet, there's a big, huge thing of purple clothing, and then there's a few other colors, but it's really a lot of purple, or things in the purple family. Yeah, my maroon dress is almost like purple. Your maroon dress that you're wearing right now, underneath your Elsa dress? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's looking pretty. How okay. about, do you want to put the ribbon on? Let's put the ribbon on really quick okay. so we can show the boys and girls at home how to do it. I'll do that for you. Okay. So we cut the hole in the middle right here. So we're just going to put it through here. There you go. 
We need to tie that first. Yep, we're going to tie two knots because if you just do one, it's not going to stay. So we're going to do one more. There you go. So there you go. It's going to reflect. You can hang it wherever you want. Madeline likes to hang it here in the house um, on like door handles or you can put it in a tree outside and let the light from the sun reflect on it. It's really up to you but it's a really cool uh, art craft that you can do here at home and you can use things that you probably already have like those old CDs that I know a lot of us have that we're not using anymore. So instead of throwing them away there's another use for them. So Madeline that was a lot of fun huh making the the sea turtle? Yeah. Yeah, and you know what? You know, you can make any type of animal, animal with these old CDs. You can make yeah. fish, you can make sharks. Or you can make doggies. You can make, maybe you can make doggies. But it's really up to you. I like making it with a turtle because turtles have that hard shell and that's kind of what the CD is. And then we can, like I said, we just decorated it. So anyways, what was your favorite part? Uh... The purple jewels, right? Okay, well I I like yours and I I like mine too. It's pretty cool. Look at those crazy eyes. Look at they're moving. All right, everyone. Well, we had a lot of fun. Don't forget to hit thumbs up or if you have any questions or tell us what you like the most about the video or if you have other ideas for animals that you can make using old CDs, let us know by leaving us a comment and don't forget to hit subscribe. See you next time. Bye. Bye.